Hello everyone, my name is Joshua Wolfie and welcome back to Minecraft. So, in our realm that we actually finally established our little settlement. Or actually no, it's actually grown into a bigger settlement this time. And you'll be impressive. So right now we are in my house. Yes, my, this is my house. So, as you can see we are somewhere above the clouds, somewhere. And as you can see down below is our civilization which I'm gonna go near that area soon so yeah this is my room my lanterns my chest of things kind of okay all right we're gonna go down here down here and yes my security door as you can see I'm Still sort of working on the fence line right now, but yeah. So my friends discovered some carrots and potato, which is very useful. As you can see, this is my garden. Yeah, look at all the fine wheats. And of course, the bamboo is growing nicely, including the berry bush, which is a pain in the ass when you touch them. Also good for defense, depending if you're in the ground. So I got my carrots growing. I got my potatoes and my chicken. I did try to bring in the um, cow up. It ended up being, it died pretty much, yeah. So I can't do anything about it. So I also got some kelp, some lovely, lovely kelp, some seaweed. And I swear, where did my salmon go? Okay. It keeps disappearing. Why are you disappearing? There was two. There was four, and now there's only one left. Uh, how's the cod doing? See, that's the thing. They're they're, they're disappearing. I don't understand what's going on. There, there's plenty of room in that water, or maybe it's not big enough. Well, we'll see what happens. All right. So this is my ultimate storage room of absolutely little stuff. As you can see, I. I don't have been collecting. I've been building a lot. Yeah, so I... This is what I've been doing. I've been building my house the entire day right now. That's... No, actually, I would just say that. It, takes, it took me a lot longer than that. So, yeah. As you can see, I've been... Bit, so busy building, I haven't been gathering a lot. Because I am still... Am, Still gathering some items. Right now, I don't have that much stuff with me, but yeah. So, let's see here. Iron ingots. This is all the iron I got left. All the gravel. All that. And all that other stuff. Yeah. Yeah, I got some concrete. Black and white and orange to make my little section, but that's about it. I'm saving that for any kind of repairs. So this is my crafting station here. And my cobblestone generator right here. Psst. Yep. My cobblestone generator. I'm just gonna leave that right there. Yep. So I got my my workbench, my loom, my saw, and down level, yep. Oh yeah, my flags. <laughs> oh yes, this is also to keep the intruders away. I improved it. Oh yes, I do. I I can't believe I overlooked it. I do have a resource pack on, including an Optifine and the shader. So I got three things to this, as you can pretty much tell from the uh, resource pack that I installed into the well, to my side, to my Minecraft realm. I can. So this is what I'm seeing in my Minecraft realm, the one I created. And unfortunately, because it's so nice, the glass is like invisible. It, I'm thinking wall. I'm walking a wall, but no, there is a bit of glass. Okay, and this is why I added security because apparently one of my friends snuck in here. So right now I had to use a city, and just so they don't start bringing my shit again. So this is my top-down view of the world, our world, I should say. So as you can see, we actually built. The rail system. 
So right now, all the rail system actually leads to my friend uh, Lord uh, Lord Kale place. So we're treating it as a train hub right now. <laughs> but that is still his home. That his main base right there. That 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 whole little mountain section. If that's his home. Right now, that's Kaipo's home right there. But his farm extended out that way, and this is. I built that one in creative, the village. The village one, I created for that purpose, for us to use whenever. But we have to also protect it, too. Because that's our resources use when we need them. And that was just when day... That was day one of the house. So this is the same server. Yeah. Oh, yes. And this is my friend Austin's house. As you can see, his place is surrounded by bamboo and also the berry bushes. Alright, let's go. Okay, I want to make sure it's open. Yeah, I just block it because there's no way. Alright, so I'll leave it unlocked and jump off. Trust me, this is the quickest and efficient way of getting around. So while the day is still up... Let's do some. Let's do some touring. So yeah, this is, was the the day one house I made, just so I can hide. Again, these stupid ass bushes. I hate those, but I also like them because they give you food. Oh yes, I spawn in some this type of plant for my house, so I have to. So all I did was grab from one sapling and then it grows expanded from there. But like I said, I only did it so I can make more wood out of it. Which I'll probably do later. So since Austin's on this side, we we could just start here. <laughs> so this is his horse. And the only way to get in is through this entry, which I'm trying to figure out why did he left that open. Alright, so. Oh, perfect. The train's here. Good. Alright, so. Down here is his underground special farm. Oh my god. Yeah, so this is all of his potatoes and carrots. I don't know why he made it just one block right here. Okay. But yeah, this is his underground stash farm. Alright, close this so that way none of the monster gets through. And this is his pig farm and his chicken farm. And the one llama I spawned for him because he was really testy because his other llama disappeared. But I keep telling him it's a traitor llama, which, you know, you can't do anything about. Waikiki Aquarium, right. Alright, so you're wondering how you get in here. Well, now you know. You open the door, you got, you got to... You gotta stand right in front of the door and click the door open. That way you can squat down. As you can see, it's like I'm swimming in the water. It's so funny. <laughs> so he actually figured this out for himself. And where did the fishes go? Where what? Where did the fishes go? Oh, the fish is right there. Oh, they're all right there. Oh, they're over there. Okay. I wonder why they're over there. They're not right here. So, yeah. I kind of made this in creative for his... So, the whole purpose for this one is just for him to look at something pretty to admire. So, this is his bed. Yeah. So, I, d I helped him about help him out with this. At least this is all designed. So, I didn't care about that. Alright, so... Wait, is it almost daytime already? Sorry. I, I, I just don't want to deal with the creepers right now. So, this is a train system that leads to the village. Which we're going to route the ride. Yee! Oh my god. Yeah, so we light up the system. That way, no monsters will go near us. Hopefully. Perfect. We're here. Um, I might send it back, actually. There you go. <laughs> so,
So yeah, welcome to the village. Um, where there was some technical issues. There was some. I think some of the villagers were lost because this house was torn down by something. Don't know what, but yeah. And then we got some iron gold. Oh my god, you stupid villagers. Trample over the crops again. Yeah, you. You're not doing your job. Huh. Potatoes. 26 potatoes. Oh, okay. So right now, they're all novice. Mo I think most of them are pretty much a novice. So, because they need they need to trade. But like I said, this is the, that's the whole purpose of this village, is for us to trade and stuff like that. So you get the iron golems to protect it. There was some cats, too. Where did the cats go? They look like they disappeared. Oh, well. Whatever. They'll probably come back. All right, so anyway, let's go to uh, Carl's house since that's on the on the way. Here we go. Uh, Kaipo's house is coming along nice. Oh, lag. Ah, lag. Oh no, no, no! Your stupid card system. I told him another cart was a stupid idea. Okay, you know what? Give me this. Yeah, you know what? Forget it. No more cart. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, I told him that two cart was a bit too much. It should only be one cart. But no, he had to put two carts. So I just... Make I just made one disappear at this point. All right, so we're back here <laughs> into Kale's place. Okay. Oh my God, he still hasn't made the stairs yet. So I need food. All right, so welcome to Kale's place. Let's go downstairs for a bit. Yes, yeah, so we got some nice place. We got he had I spawned him on another llama because he was testing about the trader's llama, but I keep telling him that it despawns anyway, so yeah. Let's see here, there's nothing really important around here, just uh, another entrance way. So he has many entrance way, hopefully he has lights to keep the monsters at bay. And this is his uh boats, his little flag thingy over here. Ah, Yes, he's the CEO of this train hub. Um, let's see here. He got his um stack furnace. Chess, chess, workshop, loom. Um, this thing is nothing. It's only for the villagers. He has his bed. Let's go upstairs some more. Again, it's a nice, lovely view of this place. It's a view. I mean, it's a, has a, it has a nice view, I have to admit. It is a nice view. Unfortunately, there's still monsters that spawns here, so I have to be careful. Alright, so let's go down here. It's very elaborate, sorry. <laughs> oh yes, this is his little waterfall. I think he made that. And that's his wheat farm, which I, I helped him uh, light torches at least. And this is his bamboo stack, <laughs> which is all grown. <laughs> and his tree hub. Oh, that's right. That's upstairs. I need to go upstairs. Yes, there's also an upstairs room. Um, um, how, do, how do I get up there now? It's His house is not really organized. Let's just say that. Even though he's an artist, this is what he made. So um, we'll go this way. Oh, the snow. The snow blocks is holding. Cool. So it did work. Yeah, because I keep falling off that thing. And it's not fun anymore. Alright, so you got some lovely trees. Again, another pot, a flat land for him to use. Which I'm trying to figure out why the wheat is actually still growing. It's amazing. Look at this. The wheat is still growing. I don't understand that logic. There's snow around here, and yet wheat is still growing here. I, I don't understand that. I'm kind of broken about it. Oh, well. So, whatever. 
All right, let's go to Kaipo's house. Yes, let's go to Kaipo's house. And we'll use the train system for that purpose. If I can find the engines right now. Let's see, it's there, 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 there. All right, it's going to be a short one because it's, it's really small. <laughs> wow, this is so... Oh, fuck it! I didn't turn it off yet! Fucking A. Oh shit. Oh, come on! I hit that switch. Oh my god, I hit that switch too! <clears throat> this switch thing is so complicated. That's why I keep telling them not to do this switch. Uh, zombie! Seriously? Kaipo? Oh, you didn't put light here, that's why. Need more light. Oh, he opened up the area. Nice. Yes, this is his... Uh, yeah, I told him... I taught him how to do the cobblestone generator. And look what I see. Ah, oh, he left the plates there, too. You realize that it's... A smart idea, but you can do this. And bam, it closed automatically. You don't have to deal with it anymore. Oh, so this is where the horse went. Oh, yeah, there was a bunch of skeleton art, uh, horse later on, which I'm going to show in a later video. Oh, oh, that's it? That's all he expended it? I thought he would have expended more. Oh, okay. I wonder if there's a secret room in there now. Or just a wall. I thought he would just extend it, but I guess he didn't. Okay. Whatever. Um, let's explore some more because yeah. Let's go upstairs. Oh, there's no Let's put a light up there. He's not done yet. <laughs> okay. Oh look, an outside um how the where's that freaking lighter? Oh, it's right here. Ow! I didn't mean to do, do that. There. Why is it so dark here? Holy shit! Whoa! Ho, ho, ho. He found actual one of those cave... Uh, canyons. I also got one of those cave canyons too. Which I have to show later. So I did find another cave. Okay. Okay. Whoa! He actually built all this stuff? Oh my god. Yeah, this is actually... I don't know what he's been doing, but he's been building a lot. Wow. This is amazing. Oh yes, his little design. You got his pig farm right here. All the piggies, his horse, and the uh, whatever empty area this is. Oh, there's the cows. Oh, more wheat farm. Holy shit, this guy's been doing. This guy's been busy. He's been busy. Ah, okay. I was wondering if he's going to add the fence now. <laughs> With the berry bush. Uh oh, monster is going to pop up. Hang on. Sorry. Don't want to deal with monsters right now. So, yeah, my friend's been busy. So, this is a special garden area. Hmm. The only problem is this does not act as a barrier because the mo monsters can just walk around. But each to his own. And more chests, more workstation, and all that. So he's going to expand some more. I know that already. Which I'm going to have to do something about it too. So I'm probably going to make one of those uh, cook chicken farming thing device. Yeah. Alright, let's see here. What else we haven't done? Have we done everything else? 
let's see here. Went through my house. We went to Austin's house. We went to Kale's house. We went to Ethan's house. We went to the village. I mean, you, we can go to the mine shaft, but I don't think we really need to do that. So, hang on. I want to go in creative mode so I can give you the bird's eye view of this place. Away from the sun view. <laughs> Alright, so, as you can see, that's what it looks like from the top. <laughs> so, yeah, this is our little um, community. Um, I don't know how to get the best angle of this thing. Maybe if I go on this side. Yeah, here we go. There. Yeah, you can see it. You can see um, Carl's house, uh, Kale's house, uh, uh, Kale's house, Kaipo's house, Austin, and my house, and it's, and also um, Ethan's farmland, <laughs> and the village that we're protecting, and the rail system. So yeah, so this is our community, and we're still gonna continue to grow on it. So I'm ha I'm really happy how it's be how it's developing at this point so I'm really happy and I want to thank thanks to my friends for being a part of it so yeah so thank you guys um oh shit no you no you that uh, weather damn it you clear ah oh, I don't like that every time they do that I'm trying to have a moment here so yeah I want to thank you guys so much for being part of this community and I'm hoping we can still do all the stupid shit and all the craziness that we do all the time. Exploring, pranking, getting ourselves killed. Yeah, so I, would, I do look forward to that. Yeah, and I, yeah, again, my friends, thank you so much for being part of this. Again, we're going to grow. I'm going to see if I can invite some more people. Maybe. We'll see what happens. So. Anyway, guys. Thank you guys so much for taking time watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe, please. Leave a like if you like the video. Leave a comment behind if you want to talk about it. And I'll see you guys in the other video. Laters.